The start game is very crucial since you will most likely have to get through one squad or two before you can continue on. Both the RE45 and alternators are guns that you will most likely find and run with in the beginning of the game. So the question is, which is better? In this video I'm going to be telling you about the guns and I'm going to tell you which ones to use in different situations. So be sure to stick around to the end because there's not just one answer. Also if this is your first time to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button for more daily tips and tricks videos. So with all that out of the way, let's get to the video. The RE45 is a pistol that can hold 3 attachments. It will be 4 after the new update for Season 2 and I'll probably make another addition to this video to see which one is better with the new hop ups for these guns. The RE45 can be equipped with a barrel stabilizer, optic, and a light extended mag. It holds 15 bullets with no mag, 18 with common, 21 with rare, and 24 with epic. Its DPS is 137 and has a recoil that takes the gun up and to the right. It does 11 to the body, 10 to the legs, and 16 to the head. The alternator can be equipped with a barrel stabilizer, optic, light extended mag, and a standard stock. After the update for Season 2, this will be 5 with a hop up. It holds 16 bullets with no mag, 20 with common, 23 with rare, and 26 with epic. Its DPS is 138 and has a recoil that takes the gun up. It does 13 to the body, 11 to the legs, and 19 to the head. Statistically, the alternator is better. It does more damage with every shot and has a higher DPS, but only by one. It holds more bullets and is easier to control. It also will end up using less bullets over time. But this does not mean it's always the best one to pick up. I have a question for you. Are you more skilled with an R99 or a Spitfire? If you answered R99, the RE45 is the better weapon for you. If you answer Spitfire, you should probably run with the alternator. The alternator is much more stable and easier to control, but it's much slower, so you will need to hit your shots. The RE45 sprays bullets, but reloads much quicker. My preference is the RE45 because it's more natural for me to control it. The alternator is a bit slow for me and will only be able to take you so far since an R99 will shred right through it. An RE45 will be able to keep up with the proper moves and can be able to defeat the R99. If you're thinking long term, RE45 is the way to go. But if you need a hard hitting, easy to control gun for now, just go with the alternator. If you're still stuck on which one that you should use, I have one tip for you. It all depends on the extended mag. In most cases, the RE45 will take more than one clip to down a person if they have body armor. If you have a blue light extended mag, or better, pick up the RE45. If you have anything lower than that, run with the alternator. Hopefully with the help of this video, you now know which gun suits you the best. Let me know in the comment section which gun you prefer. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video with your friends and teammates. I'll see you in the next video.